Hey, it's Corey Mayo, licensed realtor with Monument Sotheby's and the lead with the Corey Mayo team located here in coastal Delaware. And today I'm here showing you a spec home by D.R. Horton located in the community of Headwater Cove. This is a Galveston floor plan. Uh, it's a little bit unique. It actually has a loft on it. This comes standard as a one-story floor plan uh, and they opted to add that loft. So it's pretty cool. Um, current pricing as of today, this is uh, November 22nd of 2023. Pricing as of today is $569,990. Um, there's options and uh, home site premium. So for example, this is located on a pond lot um, that equal well above and beyond that price. But um, Dare Horton has some pretty aggressive uh, pricing and sales that are going on right now. So this is definitely one to consider. Um, please make sure before we do our tour that you hit that subscribe button and that notification bell. Follow my channel so that way you're made aware of um, other tours I do, whether it be drive through tours or other model or spec homes that I do. But without further ado, let's flip this camera around here. We'll head out front, take a look at the home from the front elevation of it and work our way through all the way up into the loft where we will end everything off. So let's go check this thing out. This particular home is located on home site 56. You'll notice this elevation, they've opted for a lot of these stone accents on the front of the home. Concrete sidewalks and driveways, as opposed to some communities that are, that have a macadam or blacktop. A little bit more of an upscale feel. Have these nice pillars and front patio as you come towards the front of the home. As we enter the foyer area here, we have a nice long foyer with some nice crown molding accents. On either side of the foyer, we'll see custom millwork. Now directly to the left of the front door as we come in, we have these French doors that will lead into a flex room. So this could be a little sitting room or an office or a den, pretty much however you would decide to utilize this space, but we have three standard in this floor plan on the one bedroom would be three bedrooms with the flex room. But this also has the upstairs, which is going to get us a loft, an additional bedroom and an additional bathroom. So to the right, is we're gonna find two bedrooms and a bathroom. We'll turn right to go towards the front of the home. This would be a guest bathroom or a guest bedroom number one. Heading back out to the hall, the next door is going to be our guest bath, dual sinks, and a shove tower, uh, shove hub shower combo with pile walls. And we notice the floor in here, we have LVP in all of our main living spaces and all of our wet spaces. And then we have carpet in our living spaces like the bedrooms and this uh, and the flex room, which would be guest bedroom number two, similar size to that first bedroom. This would be looking at, uh, located on the side of the home. Carpet in here. Back out into the foyer, we'll head through this opening into the main living space. We're gonna have our dining, living, and kitchen open floor plan here. Now this one, they also opted to add the angled fireplace, which is an option. Do the nice open floor plan on the kitchen here with that large island, quartz countertops. We have a hood with a um, cooktop and then a built-in oven and built-in microwave. All stainless steel appliances. Three windows facing the rear of the home and then off of these the dining living I'm sorry off of the uh, great room and kitchen is going to be our dining room continuing with that trim work flowing from the foyer all the way into our dining space three transom windows which will be located on the side of the home 
then a sliding glass door located on the rear corner. Come out here to this covered patio with this amazing view of the pond. So this would be an, an upgrade that is included in the price. They've already started their uh, finishing of the edge of the pond. Nice, beautiful view here. Typically this roof line would come flat, but then you see where that loft comes. in here into the dining space. And we'll continue through to the owner's suite first before we go upstairs. So we have this nice little kind of right angle soft entryway that allows to have some privacy into your owner's suite from the main living space. The two windows in this room are gonna be located on the rear of the home overlooking that pond view. Off of the owner's bedroom, we'll go into the owner's bathroom, dual sinks. We have true tile flooring here. A walk-in closet is gonna be located off of the owner's bath. and then our water closet. Go ahead back out into the main living space. Before we go up first, we'll make a left. See, this is where our laundry is located. Gear Horton is one of the few builders that actually will include all of your appliances, so the home will come with a washer and dryer. And you'll notice also all the windows are outfitted with two inch faux wood blinds. Roughly $2,000 worth of blinds included with that. Up this landing, make the right. This will be where our loft is. The mechanicals will be located on this closet right here. And then directly off of the loft, I have a full bathroom, that shower tub combo again, like we saw downstairs, LVP flooring, and then directly off the loft is gonna be our third guest room. So we have three guest rooms, a full owner suite, and then also a flex room. So lots of options here. If you have any questions at all about this home or about Headwater Cove, really anything that has to do with building, buying, or selling here in coastal Delaware, you can feel free to reach out to me. Again, my name is Corey Mayo. I'm a licensed realtor with Monument Subbies and the lead for the Corey Mayo team located here in coastal Delaware. Please make sure you hit that subscribe button and that notification bell so that way you are, are notified when I upload new videos. But again, this house is available for sale. If you like this particular home, I can help you get in here. So give me a call. I hope you have a great rest of your day. I look forward to hearing from you soon.